What? No, Blaine, go! Go! No, it's cool, I'm on the hands free! Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, yeah, that's great! Yes! Ciao! Minicab! 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 Much cheaper, cheap price! Minicab! Minicab! I'm from uh, Switzerland. Really? Yes. And I am here uh, practicing the English. <laughs> How are you getting on? You are from Yorkshire? No, no, London. Yeah. No. Um, I can assure you that these eggs were fresh this morning. What eggs? Yeah. I can assure you yeah. that these eggs were fresh this morning. Allow me to offer you a complimentary glass of champagne because the chef has ruined your meal. Oh. Hmm? Very nice. Is there anyone here in the restaurant who is medically equipped to deal with botulism? photo, 50 pence, you get a nice view of the uh, parliament with the pigeons. It's okay? Okay. okay. I put you here. Just you, sir. Okay. You stand here. You hold this sign. Hello from London, please. So they know where you are. Okay? Okay. So, you look at the big smile. You see it? Big smile. Smile, you're happy, goddammit. You ready? One, two, three. Something kind of hit me today. I looked at you and wondered if you saw things my way. People will hold us to blame. It hit me today. It hit me today. I am I'm sorry that you and your wife are suffering from diarrhea. No, not really. No. <laughs> if you are still bleeding in two days, please see a doctor and the restaurant will pay for it. Oh, that's nice. I heard all your controls were jammed. Well, it's just nice to have you back again But I guess they still don't understand And they can never understand Yes, hello, this is the telephone engineer. Yeah? Uh, I'm just giving a warning out to people. Are you on the corner of Portobello Road? 
Yes. Yeah, just want you to keep a lookout. We've had some problems with a gang of squirrels going around. Oh, sorry, I don't understand. I'm a Spanish. Well, we've just had a problem with a gang of squirrels just uh, wandering around causing trouble. So if you see any, just uh, let us know and we'll send someone round, OK? OK. OK, bye. Okay, bye. Cos mother says I was a great mistake And overcame before the soul You better give me something to fill the hole <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't know. Pretend like you're shopping. Pretend you're shopping. Pretend you're shopping, please. The people who run this shop, people who run this shop have held me prisoner here. Please don't look. They're looking. The people who run this shop, they're keeping me prisoner here. And at night, they get their friends come round. They keep me in a small room up there. And they throw tuna fish at me. And Shh. Peas, they're just over there. Yes, second row. Second row, peas. And quick, please get the police. They keep me in a small box and they don't let me out. And sometimes they have friends who come and kick me like a football. Could be my with a small van and to meet me here about seven and we can make a break for France. But they don't let me out. They keep me in a small in a small cupboard in the back. Do you think you could do me a big favour? A van, 20 people, and we can be in France by 10. The shaman that the chef has prepared for you will not cause you the shamonella that you caught two weeks ago. Thank you for returning to the restaurant and having confidence in us again. Mm. This time, there will be no projectile vomiting. Ian McCaskill, again, you are known as probably the most famous weather forecaster in Britain. What sort of machines are going to come which are going to help us predict the future of weather? I think bigger and better or smaller and faster computers. That's the thing. It's all down to computers. It's no longer the human being. For that, when I was learning, it was, it was sort of string, ceiling wax, pencil and rubber. Now, mm -hmm. of course, it's computers. It will always be computers. Uh, it the it faster... <coughs> These guys raced us up the motorway here. Forget it. Ignore them. Just leave them. They were, they were outside the shop, I don't know what they were doing, yeah. yeah. Mr McCaskill, um, you are the... Hang on. Hey, what do you guys want? What's the... Oh, Christ! Oh! money. I got the money. Just let her go, please. I've got the money. It's all yours here. It's all yours. Just let her go, please. It's all yours. What? Please, just let her go. I've been through enough, mate. What? Please. I don't know what you're on about. Are you not the... Oh, I'm not. No. no. Sorry, mate. I think I got the wrong person. Sorry. 
Can we just keep an eye out for the Rosas while I nick that uh, old lady's dog, would you? I need to nick that old lady's dog. Would you just keep an eye out for the Rosas? Yeah? I'm bloody licking it in life! I've got the bloody dog! I've got the bloody dog! You're the... Jimmy Sweet. Oh, excellent, thanks. Why? Can't be too careful. <laughs> We've had two burglaries in the last two months, so... Really? Yeah, I'm not... Oh, okay. Keen about letting people in. You got your brushes, or do you want to come and have a look at it yeah, first? I'll have a look at it first. All right. This hasn't been used for quite a long time. Right. And uh, it's it's been blocked. I mean, we tried to put something underneath and do it, and that's, I'm not quite sure what's up it. I don't know oh. how to look up or anything. <laughs> do you want to have a look? It's got a pigeon or something, I think. Up there. Jesus! Get him, get him! Get him! Oi! Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we are about to start. We are the String Quartet uh, from Toulouse, and we will be doing six songs for you uh, today. This first one uh, is called Mon Chien m'a laissé sur le côté de la ville, mais finalement, je préfère les chats. Okay. One, two. Is this uh, dry clean as a hamster? Yes. Yeah, number 80. Someone sent you a vain gorilla from the uh, specialist deliveries. Someone sent you a vain gorilla, Graham. Is it a birthday or something? OK. Anyway, enjoy him. What? I don't know what it is. Enjoy him, but don't feed him, yeah? Everyone can see. Mm -hmm. Is everything free food for hungry London every day? Food? Yeah, so we ask people to help with some donations. What do you want, potatoes? My God. You want potatoes? <laughs> hmm? I got forks, <laughs> potatoes. You see what you like? I called you from the hotel phone. I haven't dialed this code before. I'm sleeping later, waking later. I'm eating less and thinking more. And how am I without you? Am I more myself or less myself? I feel younger, louder And like I don't always connect Like I don't ever connect And do you like being single? Congratulations oh. to our one million!
Excuse me, mate, you couldn't just do me an enormous favour? Yeah. Can you just hold that? I'm just trying to measure around the corner and my mate's off on tea break. Just a girl who can't say no And a sweetheart on the road Parents named the Jupiter Blessed with a lucky soul He's a boy who never cries Who's it for? Melanie. Oh, yeah. Slag. Let's <laughs> have a look. Melanie's <laughs> She gets flowers every day, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Dear Melanie, I'm very sorry for all that's happened. Can we see each other again? <laughs> Fat chance. <laughs> She's seeing three blokes. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> do you... Uh, I'll sign yeah, I'll sign anyway, whatever. Yeah. There you go. Is that all right? All right, cheers. Yeah, thanks a lot. Cheers. If you could read my mind, love What a tale my thoughts could tell Just like an old-time movie About a ghost from a wishing well In a castle dark Or a fortress strong With chains upon my feet Dickie Bird, you are probably, well, without doubt, the greatest living cricket test umpire. Um, who, looking back over the sort of span of time you've done, you know, dealing with cricket uh, matches, who is your favourite player of all time? Firstly, I'd just like to say thank you for the tremendous compliment. Right. That's marvellous. <laughs> uh, I would think, the, uh, of all the greats that I've seen, I've stood out there in the middle. I'll talk as a player, because I played county cricket for Yorkshire and sure. Leicestershire as well. But I would think probably the greatest all-round cricketer that I've seen, without a shadow of doubt, is Garfield Sobers, the West Indies. Right. To me, if there's been one better than Sobers, I would have loved to have seen him play. Can I just stop you there, Dickie? Sorry. Because so, we're in quite a rush, so okay. can we just... Um, yeah, so can we try and condense quick. it into uh, okay. something very quick, okay. you know, more... Uh, so I'll do a better quicker. one. So yeah. we'll start again, okay. shall we? Uh, Dickie Bird, you're the world's greatest living test umpire. Um, well, who would you <laughs> most admire in cricket? Quickly. Uh, the most I admire in cricket is Sir Garfield Sobers, the best all-round cricketer that I've ever seen. If there's been one better than Sobers, okay, I that's would have fine. To see that's fine. Play. Just Sir Garfield, okay. okay. And um, bowler, bowler-wise, who do, who did you like? Um, who was your favourite bowler? I think, without a shadow of doubt, fast bowler, the greatest fast bowler I've ever seen is Dennis Lilly, without a shadow of doubt. Okay. Um, oh, God, I'm late now. Um, do, 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 do. Do again, no, uh, yeah, just quickly, really. Uh, yeah. Who who is your favourite bowler? Without a shadow of doubt, Dennis Lilly of Australia. Right. Hang on. I'm going to miss it, otherwise I'm going to miss it. Sorry. Um, cancel my lunch for tomorrow, OK? John? Where's he gone? You can see us uh, next week. We are playing with Michael Nyman at the uh, Royal Festival Hall for an experimental uh, little concert. But at the moment, we are doing a tour of uh, shopping centers to bring the classical music to a different public. This next song is called Ma Marmite m'a laissé avec ma mamie. Alors, je suis allé à Paris et j'ai payé pour une femme. I uh, hope you like it. Un, deux, trois. Thank <laughs> you. 